The ladies of Bait and Reel Adventures love to go wherever the fish are. And when sail fish are an option, you better bet they'll jump at the chance. This time around, they hopped a plane to Isla Mujeres, Mexico to fish the blue waters in search of sailfish. Isla Mujeres, Mexico. The name translates to Island of Women because the Maya used to worship the goddess Ishel here. She even has a temple located at the southern tip of the island. So it's appropriate that the Bait and Reel Adventures ladies would end up here to fish for sailfish. No fancy camera crew on this trip, just the ladies and some GoPro cameras to capture the beauty above and below the water. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the sights of sailfishing in Isla Mujeres, Mexico. Nancy brought Lisa and behind-the-scenes guy Keith along for this three-day trip. With a camera hooked to the dredge to catch the underwater world and a couple on the boat above water, we'll get to see both angles. Their first day out was not a typical day for Isla, with 8 to 10 foot seas, cloudy and overcast. But Keith and Nancy were able to pull in a total of 12 sails for the day. They fished the birds with dead bait, ballyhoo, meaning they targeted the presence of the birds to find the bait balls, which are comprised of sardines. Multiple sailfish swim around the bait ball, encircling and containing it. Then they swat the fish with their bills and stun them. As the bait fish are falling, the sailfish come up to eat them from underneath. So when you're fishing the birds for sails, when you get in the midst of the bait ball, you have to let your bait drop, just letting the line out with a light finger on the spool, as you're trying to simulate the same condition of falling stunned bait fish.
Hey captains, want to feature your sport fishing business on Bait and Real Adventures? Call us at 484-256-6185 or send us an email. Let's go catch it on Bait and Real Adventures. <laughs> Day two of the trip to Isla Mujeres for Bait and Reel Adventures, and this time Lisa is out to fish for sailfish with Nancy and Keith. It was rainy and rough, six to eight foot seas, but that didn't stop the ladies and Keith at all. They fished the birds again, and Lisa ended up catching three sailfish, including her first sailfish catch ever. Keith and Nancy each caught two, and Nancy pulled in a nice bull dolphin, also known as mahi, which they enjoyed for dinner. Hey captains, want to feature your sport fishing business on Bait and Reel Adventures? Call us at 484-256-6185 or send us an email. Let's go catch it on Bait and Reel Adventures.
Despite some less than favorable weather in Isla Mujeres, Nancy, Lisa, and Keith have had a lot of fun on this trip. Lisa caught her first ever sailfish, and Nancy and Keith have caught their fair share of them too. On day three, Nancy was the sole angler. She's normally used to averaging 30 sailfish per day with two anglers, so the past couple of days kind of left her wanting for more, and she got her wish with 19 sailfish and one dolphin on this day. According to Nancy, that's the fishing she knows Isla to be famous for. Bait and Real Adventures trip to Isla Mujeres turned out to be a lot of fun and a lot of fish overall. Lisa caught her first sailfish, and Nancy and Keith brought in quite a few as well. They ended up with a total of 38 sailfish and two dolphin over three days. Plus, a trip to Isla Mujeres is always a blast. Knowing Nancy and the ladies of Bait and Real Adventures, we never know where they'll show up next, but we do know they can't wait to get out there and catch some fish. See you next time. Anywhere we drop a line, we're catching fish on Bait and Real Adventures. Right here.